So we're waiting for Stefan to arrive to Athens, the airport, and we're waiting for him right now in the car. We're gonna drive to Costa Navarino, it's a three and a half hour drive. And then when we get there, we're just gonna enjoy life. Who is back? Look, who is back? First stop before making our way to Costa Navarino is the Isthmus of Corinth, which is also referred to as the Neck. It is the part that connects mainland Greece with the Peloponnese Peninsula, which is right here. There are boats passing here, there are, there's a lot of traffic, and it's probably one of the most, let's say, uh, iconic, fascinating spots to check out uh, when you cross uh, to the Peloponnese side. We were learning a lot about it in school, so just think of it as the Neck. That's the definition of uh, Isthmos in Greek. Here. Golf day. I'm excited. Last time I played golf was in Monaco. Europe's best golf course. Best way to top it off. Who's excited for some golf? Let's go. We don't know if it's the right size, so if it's a different size, let us know. We will find uh, of course. Uh, the right one. Oh. We, we can give you uh, more buggies if need be. Um, Is it okay to have one more? Yeah. For Eduardo, because he needs uh, one. No. Three hours in the car. That's my life. That's my life these days. Being stuck in a car, going somewhere. We're going to the driving range to start with practice shots to feel ready for the uh, for the bigger course. This is looking very clean, I tell you that. This is looking so well organized and put together. Very impressed so far. Here you go. We just arrived. Your speaker, huh? Ready to smash some balls. I might not be great at golf, but can you do this? It was a nice one? Yes, it was. My, it, this is my basics. <laughs> Easy. Ask him if it was good. Man, it, that was hot. Hot! Complete disaster for me. The second but at shot least, was very good. At least I'm good in trick shots. We are officially done with golf for today. Time to eat some good food. Time to relax. Maybe go swim to the pool. So yeah, maybe to the sea. This Do you mozza know mozzarella bianca? This is mozzarella tan. Man, this is horrendous. Mozzarella bianca. We need to uh, help you get rid of this mozzarella tan. It doesn't this look very bad. sexy. Actually, it has to become halloumi grill. Halloumi grill. Don't you funny and that's how it is. Chin chin. Chin chin. Hello? We are going for the interview. We're gonna kill it. For the interview. We're gonna it's gonna be great success. Nick, I don't know if you'll be watching this. Mr. Kyrgios, please come to North Costa Navarina. I'd like a revenge match. And uh, no talking this time. Pure tennis. <laughs> First grass court in Greece. Por favor. Uh, normally, the sidelines are a bit thicker. Okay. 
Made it. Peaceful, green, calm, windy. We're here, paradise, golf paradise. It's a bit chillier than the rest of Europe. Like I was in Mallorca a few weeks ago. I was in the South of France. I just came back from Berlin from the Coldplay concert, which uh, was pretty warm. Uh, the city was packed with people. It was uh, very close to a heat wave in Berlin. And uh, now I'm here, it's a bit chillier, which is unusual for Greece at this time of the year. And you know, it's, it's not that bad. I mean, we're late evening right now just before dinner it has this nice cold breeze I'm enjoying it you know who's really psyched about this whole experience my friend Victor who plays professional golf he's been talking about the golf course here just like has been breaking my and he's been so excited about this whole experience he's literally a guy who would wake up five in the morning every single day and play golf for five to six hours uh, straight and he just takes the buggy and just goes at it, just puts everything he has at it. And I don't think I will be in that sort of mode myself, waking up at five. Because yeah, summer vacation, like who cares about golf? Like I love golf, but I'm not gonna sacrifice my sleep to go play that early. I wonder what time he's gonna go to sleep because I don't know a lot of people going to bed at nine o'clock um, the night before. Let's see if he manages to deal with it. The rest of us, vacation mode. Breakfast of champions. Kids, eat your fruits, eat your vegetables. Our stay at the Costa Navarino has come to an end. We stayed here for three days. We had a blast, an amazing time with uh, all the friends. Now, moving on to the boat trip around the Ionian Sea. We're gonna have an epic time. I can't wait for that. Ionian is known for its very mellow, calm wind and for its amazing beaches and uh, sea. We go for the even more epic adventure now. See you there. <laughs> Just arrived to Zakynthos. It's such a beautiful island. And we're gonna live it up! Ow! <laughs> it's our first island. We're going to experience the local food here, making our way to a local tavern. First great sign is that there are not many tourists here, which will make this a much more authentic experience because tourists are everywhere these days in our country now here's one right here I'm a tourist too that's Greek? looks like looks like <laughs> What's your favorite snack here? Uh, everything that the shop has to offer. Uh, but my favorite, personal favorite is uh, usually the Greek ones. That's why I will never get them out. That's nice. What's in the back? We got. Uh, this is uh, Michael Clark and this is my back check. <laughs> <laughs> we have seven days uh, Chureki. For the captain and the crew. For the captain and the crew. More chocolate for the captain uh, uh, to have full of energy. Yeah, I see you want him to stay fit. It's stay great. Fit. Oh, stay some chocolate job, milk because uh, we want him hydrated. Some paper. More chocolate. Uh, we might need to hit the, the gyms. The gyms. <laughs> All the gyms. <laughs> Hey guys, we're here at the Shipwreck Beach, also known as Navajo in Greek. The story behind this uh, thing that you see behind me, it was an illegal ship in the 1980s uh, which carried illegal substances such as cigarettes, alcohol and even humans. And uh, it was uh, chased down by the Greek Navy and that's how it ended up here.
Greek way of eating a mango. A little Greek lesson for you, uh, boys and girls. How do you say crickets <laughs> in Greek? Didikia. Remember that? Didikia, plural. Didikas, yeah. singular. Almost close as Titipas, but not there. Not quite there yet. This is uh, Greek summer. Hearing the crickets, feeling the sun, the greenery of the Ionian Sea and the calmness about it as well. That's the thing that it really has to offer. Uh, mozzarella Bianca is, uh, is here. What a beautiful, beautiful place. We just arrived to Kefalonia. It is wonderful here, it's my first time. Uh, ice cream, as always, is a big priority uh, to enhance and make this trip better. We're actually laid back right now. We are really chilled. God, I mean, it's just the amount of food we're consuming is insane. It's just so much. Food Greek is absolutely the best, and I really miss it when I'm abroad, uh, especially the one in Greece. Uh, the one in Greece is really the most authentic, best thing you can uh, get. We'll keep enjoying, because there's nothing stopping us. Let's continue. <laughs> Made it to Patra. Patra, here we are. Tanasi, what do you know about Patra? Come here. Patra. Give me some stats, some facts about Patra. Um, very nice uh, universities. Wild females. Uh, good universities. Good universities. A good carnival. Carnival, correct. And uh, we yeah. have uh, Rio and Video not far away from here. Yeah, it's very close. But yeah, let's move on. That's it. Yeah. How are you? Where Where is our next stream gonna be? To? It's a tough question. South you get Africa. to pick the, you get to pick the spot. I just bring you there. South Africa. South Africa. Why? To see my family. To see the lions. To see the elephants. Oh, you wanna go back to your natural habitat? Yes. Where you belong. Some oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, my bad. Just came back from the boat trip. Uh, we are now at uh, Zachos, which is my favorite spot. We just had some amazing food. Some uh, very good Greek home food and we will be traveling to Monaco uh, tonight 8.30, pretty late for a flight. Christos, I hope so nice to see you again. Nice uh, to see you again. Every time you come back? Yeah, yeah, yeah. every time I'll I come back, you yeah. see, I come here. I'll be this watching you. Thank you so much. Guys, thank you very much. You, Not welcome to Villermaine if you don't come here. Let's go. Let's go. Let's do it. My boy is living the superstar life, huh? One month. on the tennis courts, running around filming. Right? You're the new just guy, but instead of being up in the mountains, you're, you're doing tennis genre. Always in the tennis court somewhere. Someone needs Portugal, to work. Portugal, Spain, um, France, Monaco, Italy. Always on the court filming something. You're no. running out of ideas of beer all uh, uh, variety. Don't play with me. Don't play with me because you're gonna get schooled. Yeah. <laughs> you wanna go with the with the other guy in the in the back? Okay, we all go. We all go. We're in the ice bath, the place that we spend the most time uh, 
besides playing tennis. That is where um, the recovery happens and also other things, but I'm not going to disclose those. Lesson number one, how to survive alone in the beach with only one coconut. Oh la la! Man! Where is it? It's all here. Fresh coconut. <laughs> Mr. Tsitsipas! I drink my water from the supermarket that I just bought. <laughs> and there are three more kilos of food right in there.